Alrighty folks, thank you for clicking on the video. So again, I'm doing this full series of videos, very focused, very short as I can make them to help everybody understand all the questions they could possibly have about the kit, the timelines. Hey, I bought a kit in May of 2021. Hey, I got a kit in August of 2022. What's different? What do I have? What do I need? Um, that's what the point of this is. Uh, in this one, we're going to talk about the relays. This is the all uh, six on high. This is basically required so that your low beams light up um, with the low beam, and then when you go on high, all six of them are lit. Um, this was not something originally planned into the kit when I first debuted it, but I think everybody agreed they had to have it. So when I first priced into the pre-buy, it did not include this cost. So as long as everybody knows out there, those kits that I shipped in the early days uh, of uh, 2021 that ended up shipping towards the latter part of 2021, uh, you kind of got this free because um, this was something I didn't plan for, but I think I knew everybody needed it and I worked it in and it was tough, but we did it. So um, let's talk about the versions of that. So stick around. You're watching Night Drive TV. So the ding, ding, dings are you guys messaging me while I'm making this video. So this was our first version. Uh, we had to make this on the fly. I ended up buying a lot of these relays and they have butt connectors. Um, basically in the middle and then I hired somebody and they made these for us um, well in-house so um, this was the original color configuration um, this is indicated in the first install video you'll see this wiring version one of these connectors has fallen off disregard that but that was an issue we had um, with these the, these angle connectors we had a special um, you know, tool to do that, to make these very tight, but the employee, you know, hit or miss sometimes. So, um, but basically that's what you would have gotten. Something with butt connectors. Some people said, man, I didn't expect something so crude. Well, look, this is, like I said, it wasn't planned in the original pricing of everything. Um, we were in the middle of the C19 craziness and the cost and the shipping problems and all kinds of things. So this was the best I could give you. Um, obviously people were like, hey, where do I put it? Uh, I can't hide it. Well, you know, wire shortages were real. So uh, that was what you got. So um, moving forward, um, obviously due to said employee issues and uh, other things, I ended up finally getting a company that was going to make these for me. And so in the updated install video that was released in August of 2022, uh, this was the this was the relay that was shown and you can see um, again not my choice uh, that the colors were that way um, but we had two blacks and two reds uh, for the people that were watching this install video the paperwork in the box told people if uh, you're watching the install video the white wire becomes uh, the, the black and the uh, i believe it was the blue wire becomes the red with the angle connectors so if you do have one of those kits and you get confused, always look at the paperwork inside of the box. I try to clear up any inconsistencies, but uh, just going back to these original ones, we were running into wire shortages. Um, so they ended up not having uh, the right colors. So some people got weird colors. Uh, the relays were really uh, kind of a weird battle, but um, we went from that, um, like I said, this configuration here to this, which is made from a company that actually makes wiring harnesses. Uh, obviously you can see we added some length to the wire within reason. Um, but again, these don't really have the best spot to, to be mounted, but this is the current uh, all six on high relay. This is how it's made and it has never changed. So you basically either had this one with butt connectors. Um, you had maybe another version that had yellow wires and things like that with butt connectors. And then we switched to this and we have never changed and have no intention of changing at this point. I think this relay is good to go. So um, we haven't had, uh, I maybe have had one failure of a relay in the time that I've been selling these. We don't see many failures. Relays are pretty reliable. Um, some cars have relays in them for 400,000 miles and 50 years, you know, 30 years. So no problems there. So pretty simple when it comes to the relays. Um, improvements we made, obviously the brass taps. Uh, if you're familiar, um, these were, these uh, angle connectors originally were kind of large. Um, the company that makes these for me, these are smaller. They fit much more snug. So if you've ever had flickering or issues of them coming off of the brass taps, um, that would be an improvement that the newer uh, relay would have. But again, I, I don't think that any of the issues with the original stuff can't be overcome. I told people at it, it, it worst, maybe take some pliers, pinch this a little bit. It'll stay on there tight. It's no big deal. Um, so again, um, 
I hope if you've watched multiple of these, um, I, I want to stress that even the first kits, the very uh, first generation kits are on people's cars, no issue. They're on my cars, no issue. Um, nothing was bad. Um, I'm just trying to improve for replacement purposes and obviously to improve the kit and things like that. So that kind of wraps up the relay video and I hope you've enjoyed it and I appreciate you supporting and watching Night Drive TV. I'll catch you again.